Startling new surveillance video obtained by 7 Action News shows a killer taking aim in a brazen murder at a gas station. Police say the victim may have witnessed something others didn't want him to see. 7 Action News reporter Jennifer Bisram has details tonight in the hunt for one of Detroit's most wanted. Larry Barnett was always busy trying to make a few bucks in his Detroit neighborhood. He will work for it. He will sweep up. He will, you know what I'm saying, watch right. people windows. He will pump gas. But in his travels, police say he may have witnessed a crime. The panhandler could have saw something. The panhandler could have um, spoke to the police about something. And on October 28th, they believe he paid the ultimate price. Take a look at this just released a chilling surveillance video at the BP gas station on 7 Mile and I-75. The victim is going to be over here by these cones. You can see his feet and that's uh, the area where he's panhandling at this time. Uh, he comes over and uh, picks up an object. Suspect arrives at the location in a vehicle but parks the vehicle in, in a disguised location comes to the gas station on foot, seeking out the victim, fires multiple shots at the victim, killing him. My brother didn't even have a safety pin on his pocket. So he just walked up wherever this guy was and just gunned him down and ran off in the dark. Detective Jeb Rutledge with DPD Homicide says it happened around 9.30 at night in front of several people. He was shooting to kill. He wasn't shooting to send a message. Larry's loved ones are now heartbroken and say their lives will never be the same. No, I would never talk to him again. That what bothers me. I never see him again. If he's that brazen to do that in that type of environment at that type of location, who knows if he's done this before or who knows if he'd do it again. Take another look at this brazen gunman who police say killed Larry Barnett. If you have any information on who he is or where he may be, call Detroit Police's tip line at 313-596-2260 or Crime Stoppers at 1-800-SPEAK-UP. You can remain anonymous. Jennifer Bisram, 7 Action News. All right, thank you much, Jennifer.